Hello and welcome to my channel or welcome back. I told you guys I was going to start being more consistent again, so here we are, except today we have a drugstore haul that I'm actually going to have to put into two parts because it's that big. The drugstore has just been killing it. There's been so many products going viral on TikTok, Instagram, YouTube, Basically, anywhere people can talk about products, people have been talking about products from the drugstore. I've been all about it. I've actually been doing more shopping at the drugstore than I have been at Sephora recently, which is very surprising because if you look back at my channel and all the videos that I posted in 2023, it's mainly Sephora hauls, but the drugstore, I, I, I'm even more excited shopping at the drugstore than I am at Sephora currently. So today part one of this haul is going to be everything except for makeup. So I have skincare, body care, fragrance, and I think a couple of hair, I think I have hair care products too. So without further ado, it's going to be a long one probably. So I don't want to keep you here too long. Get yourself a snack and let's get into it. I'm going to start off with just a few random items. Some don't really fit into any category and then others it's just like one item from that category so i purchased a backup of the candies eau de parfum travel spray trio now if you haven't seen my i believe it was my february yeah it was my february favorites i raved about the pink amber perfume from candies i had to get a backup i literally the other two smell great so it's pink apple vanilla amber and pink amber Pink apple and vanilla amber smell great, don't get me wrong, but pink amber is literally out of this world and it is such a perfect scent for spring. So I literally bought a backup of this just for pink amber. And when my drugstore closest to me no longer sells this kit, I am definitely going to be putting in an order on the Candies website uh, to purchase the body spray because it just smells phenomenal. Next product is from Quo Beauty by Conair, and this is the LED Multi Magnification Mirror. It's one, two, and three times magnification, three touch light settings, and tray base. And I purchased this in black. They actually have a bunch of different colors. My mom purchased this as well, and she got the one in the rose gold color, which is also just gorgeous. And I love this mirror. I absolutely love it. It's so clear and the light is perfect. It doesn't like change anything. So it really looks like what your makeup looks like in natural light. So that's very helpful, especially if you have to do your makeup in bad lighting. Um, the next thing is kind of very random, but I have been on the hunt for a good toothbrush that works really well, but that is also like eco-friendly. So I picked up the Oral-B Click Manual Toothbrush in Rose Quartz. So this comes with the handle and then two brush heads because you're able to reuse the base and then you just change out the heads when it's time to do so. So it's 80% reusable toothbrush, replace only the brush head. So it's a mag, oh, and it comes with a magnetic brush holder. Oh, we love it. So anything interesting that I need to tell you? No, other than that, yeah, that's it. That's it. It's just a toothbrush. And I feel like eight, using 80%, being able to use 80% of the toothbrush over and over and over again, um, and still it being very hygienic is a great thing. I've gone through bamboo toothbrushes, I've gone through like recycled plastic toothbrushes, and nothing just feels, I don't know, the bristles just didn't do it for me, but Oral-B is very reliable, and it says, hang on, what does it say about the brush head? It says, breakthrough cleansing with X-shape bristles. So it's a next generation crisscross bristles, um, X-filament technology, and yeah, so I'm very interested and the rose quartz just, you know, the fact that it's pink just makes it so cute and makes me more encouraged to purchase one like that versus from another company. So, and then last little random item is this Essie apricot nail and cuticle oil. Um, this was like not a super necessary purchase, but well, actually no, it kind of was because the cuticle oil that I have, I've literally had for probably close to 10 years. 
And with all the shopping that I do, you would think I would not be able to have a product that is that old, but here we are. Um, so this conditions nails and hydrates cuticles, which is something that I need. Uh, it's a 97% natural product and it's quick absorbing. So those were like the random little products that didn't fit into any categories for today. Okay, let's move on to hair care. Uh, so the first thing that I purchased for hair care is the Quo Beauty by Conair Cordless Mini Multi Styler. So this has a USB rechargeable body um, and it comes with a safety cover that you're able to put over uh, the clamps so that way if it's hot and you need to like throw it somewhere, you can and it's still safe. Um, I did try this once. This is actually something that I'm going to be leaving at work just in case if I want to go out after work and I need to do like a little hair touch up or I don't know, I get caught in like a blizzard or a rainstorm or something because I live in Montreal and God only knows what the weather is going to be like from you know, minute to minute. So just in case, um, I thought that this was really handy. The only thing is that this was expensive. This little mini thing was like, I think it was $75. And I'm like, excuse me, Conair, can we relax please with the pricing? Um, but yeah, I tried it once and I do really like it. It works well. I did try it to smooth and straighten a little bit like this part of my hair and then I did try it to do like a nice loose little curl so that way my hair ends up just looking like like that you know so um yeah so I really liked it I think it's really good do I think it's worth the price I mean it is what it is you know if you want a good one that's going to last you a while and that has the convenience of being rechargeable and everything, then yeah, you're going to end up spending a little bit more money. So um, next products, it's all from the same brand. And this is a brand that I had used when I was in high school and then stopped using. And then with like the Olaplex hype, I completely forgot about, but I want to incorporate this brand with um, I was, was going to say the name of the brand, use this brand with Olaplex and see, I'm just, I really want to just take care of my hair. <laughs> like I just want my hair to grow and be healthy and that's it. So I bought a couple things from the brand called NutriCap. So first thing I purchased is this hair and nail growth, grow and vitality formula that promotes hair growth and strengthens nails. These are little capsules, like little gel capsules, and you take one a day, and this is the pack of 120, so you end up um, getting a two-month supply in this box. I already started taking them, and they look like, hello? They look like this, so they are like pretty large pills, but um, they have a bunch of really good stuff in them. So. In the ingredients list, you have walnut oil, capilene, horsetail, brewer's yeast, vitamin E, B3, B5, B2, B6, B1, B8, which is biotin, niacin, thiamine, uh, riboflavin. Um, I'm sorry, you're actually supposed to take two soft gels a day. But the reason why I've been taking one is because I've been mixing them with the NutriCap gummies um, for hair, nails, and skin. So this helps to strengthen the nails and hair and improve splitting and brittle fingernails. So these are, it's basically like NutriCap's version of Sugar Bear hair, except these taste incredible. I could eat half a bottle of these and feel no type of way about it. They are the best gummies I've ever tasted. You get 90 gummies and they're supposed to be like blueberry raspberry flavor, but these just taste straight up like candy to me and they're so good. Um, I know that this has a lot more vitamins than these do. Um, so these you take one gummy per day. So I take one gummy and then one of the gel caps per day. Um, in this, in the gummies, they have vitamin A, D2, E, C, B5, B6, biotin, 
uh, folic acid, B12, iodine, and zinc, which is a fantastic blend for hair, skin, and nails. So I've been taking those together. Uh, this is actually an unopened bottle because I purchased two at the time. So I've been taking those two supplements in conjunction and we're just gonna see what happens. Uh, the next product that I got from NutriCap, I got two of them. Uh, it's fine and thinning hair um, ampoules. So like little like drops of a liquid that you put in your hair and you leave it in and then just, you know, dry your hair and style according to how you want it. So this nourishes, strengthens and revitalizes fine and thinning hair. And yeah, again, it has like a bunch of the same type of good ingredients, all like vitamins and stuff like that. This you're supposed to do, uh, so it says apply NutriCap lotion and gently massage on dry or wet hair, particularly on the sensitive areas of the scalp. Do not rinse, use at least twice a week for two months. Renew application two to three times a year. So you're supposed to do it one to two times a week. I think I've been doing it one to two times a week. I actually haven't been keeping track, which isn't that good. But um, yeah, I've been using those as well. Mm -hmm. And then these I just purchased, but I'm only gonna start using these probably when I'm at least like halfway through my Olaplex. So this is the fortifying shampoo that nourishes, strengthens, and protects with wheat germ oil and vitamin E. And then this is the nourishing conditioner that nourishes, repairs, and detangles with shea butter. So I purchased these two and yeah, so it's for all hair types and I, this might be overkill. I don't know if I'm like doing too much at once, but I'm just going to see what happens. I'm going to see what happens. I'm on a hair journey. I'm on a health journey. I'm on a skin journey. Like I just want everything to be good and healthy. So we're going to start with all of this and see, see where it goes, see where it takes us. Uh, next up, let's do body care. So everything that I purchased in body care is from the brand Truly, except for this item, which is the Olay Collagen Firming and Hydrating Body Lotion. To be honest, I bought this for the scent. Oh my God, this smells so good. I don't know if there's like almond oil in this. It says it moisturizes deeply for visibly firmer, tighter, and lifted skin. So there's uh, vitamin B3 three and collagen which is what it says yeah that's it it doesn't say anything about like almond oil or cherry oil but I feel like that is definitely in here somewhere it smells really like sweet but not overpowering so I'm very excited to try this I haven't had an Olay body lotion in a long time and I remember loving it years ago so I'm very much looking forward to trying that Let's get into the Truly products because, okay, I have I have a little bit of beef. Why is every Truly product like $30 plus? Why? And why do I keep buying Truly products when they're that expensive? I don't know, but here we are. Um, so I bought the Truly 24 Karat Gold Black Soap 2-in-1 Luxury Butter Impurity Cleanser targets face and body, blemishes and toxins. It's made with African black soap, 24 karat gold, chamomile, and turmeric. This sounded very, very interesting to me. So it looks, oh, she got a little destroyed. So it looks like this. It comes in, it's one of those metal tubes that like, you know, bend and stuff like when you squeeze it out. Um, this is 150 milliliters, five fluid ounces, and vegan, clean, cruelty-free, no harsh chemicals, high performance. The ultimate luxurious anti-aging cleanser butter infused with pure 24 karat gold gently melts away makeup, dirt, and impurities. It imparts an opulent glow. Excuse me. Do we need to open you? What is this? What are you? I'm excited. I need scissors should we try this on the back of our hand Ooh. oh I don't okay I know it's stupid because it's literally called 24 karat gold black soap but I wasn't expecting it to be black not the brightest sometimes what is this interesting 
Okay, first of all, the cap of this feels so heavy and luxurious. Like the whole packaging just feels very expensive and luxurious, which, you know, is the least that they can do if they're charging us a vital organ. Oh, it's a scrub. It smells okay. Yeah, so it's a scrub. I'm actually very surprised by that. I have to go wash this off. I will be right back. Okay, so a couple more Truly products. I got the Cocoa Cloud Aftershave Serum that has vanilla, coconut milk, argan oil, white tea, and vitamin E. So after you shave to prevent uh, razor bumps and to give your skin an extra boost of hydration, this is a really good serum to do so or so it claims. So we're going to try that. I also got the Black Jelly uh, Body Serum with black charcoal, witch hazel, tea tree, and baobab oil. Baobab. Ba that doesn't sound like a real word. Baobab. I'm probably not pronouncing that correctly, but this is what it looks like, and it's actually like, it's actually black, so that's pretty cool. Um, again, I'm just always looking for something to like exfoliate even my skin tone on my face and my body, so I thought that would be really good to do so. And then the last Truly product for body care that I bought is the Dragon Milk Anti-Blemish Anti-Perfection Body Lotion with Dragon Fruit, Lactic Acid, Blackberry Glycolic Acid, and Squalane. So all of these ingredients just like they sing to me. You know, like I love anything, acids, fruit enzymes, again, just exfoliating, brightening, evening the skin tone, whether it's face or body. So I'm very much looking forward to trying this as well. So continuing with Truly products, I bought another two Truly products. Again, we're not going to talk about the price tag. This is the Luscious Lip Butter with Peppermint and Hyaluronic Acid. So this is what the packaging looks like. And then inside, oh, it smells so good. It smells like Christmas to me. And I'm sorry, look at that texture. Don't you just want to put that on your lips? Oh my God, it smells so good. I'm so excited to try this. Anything like whipped butter, I'm just like so attracted to. And then to go hand in hand with that, this is the Unicorn Fruit Lip Plumping Balm that has peppermint, matcha, and acai. So this is what the packaging looks like. And then the inside, mm, yum. And then again, just another whipped butter product that I'm so excited about. Um, continuing on with skincare, I got, um, this is actually a repurchase from the mask bar. This is the Eye Puffiness Minimizing Eye Patches. And this comes in a box of five, so five pairs. And this helps to reduce the appearance of eye puffiness. It contains, con oh, damn. It contains cucumber extract, castor seed oil, and phytocollagen. I really enjoy these. Um, I've been trying out a lot of under eye patches and these are, the ones from Mask Bar are hands down the best that I've tried. They, I love the packaging. I love how they're wrapped. Um, very convenient and makes it very easy to apply when you apply they when you apply them they don't budge on the outside so the part that's not touching your under eye is actually like I don't know what you would call it almost like a cotton material so if you have to touch them you're not touching like the gooey eye patch you're touching like this cotton layer and then the patch that the part of the patch that touches your under eye is super hydrating super um like saturated but they don't budge they don't slide around when you stick them on they stay there until you're ready to take them off and they're just fantastic quality so to go with that i also saw that the mask bar this is called the eye lights energizing under eye roller it's brightening and helps reduce the look of eye puffiness with caffeine and coffee seed extract so this is what that looks like and it looks like this. So basically, 
it's in a squeezy tube so you squeeze out the product and then you just roll it under your i'm so sorry about that interruption my alarm just went off and it literally scared the daylights out of me um so i thought that this would be really nice to apply on my under eyes before makeup during the day and then i would use something uh, maybe a bit thicker and a bit stronger at nighttime. so i'm very much looking forward to trying this out and then makeup removing items so all from neutrogena the Neutrogena um, cleansing wipes are actually my favorite. These are the all-in-one makeup removing cleansing wipes. They're plant-based compostable wipes, which is new for Neutrogena. I got the double pack. And so this is 50 wipes in total. Each pack comes with 25 wipes. And I'm just very excited that they did ones that are environmentally friendly because, listen, makeup removing wipes are very convenient to have, but I really try my best to not use single use products as much as possible. Um, but these will last me a very long time, especially since I purchased these all in one makeup removing cleansing wipes individuals as well. So these, oh, did you see that? Did it? Okay. Um, so these are the same thing. They're plant based and compostable uh, wipes. These are individually wrapped. You get 20 in the pack and these I've been putting in my gym bag. So that way when I get to the gym, I could take off my lipstick, just put on like a chapstick and then be on my way instead of having to carry around like a big pack of wipes. So these are already open because I took out a handful, put it in my gym bag and it's very convenient to have. And then last makeup removing product from Neutrogena is this cleansing balm that melts away dirt, oil, and waterproof makeup. So I actually didn't even know that Neutrogena had come out with a makeup removing balm. And this is what it looks like. I'm fragrance free. I am very intrigued to try this because I love makeup removing balms. Uh, if you don't know, my tried and true is the Pharmacy Green Clean um, Makeup Melting Balm. I love that one with my whole heart, but she, she, she's not cheap, you know. She's a little on the pricier side. So if I can find one that I can fall in love with just as much and it's a fraction of the price, I am very open to do so. So... I'm very much looking forward to trying this. I have a couple other ones from the drugstore that I have to try too. So yeah, we're just gonna test those out and see which one suits me best. It might stay with the Pharmacy Green Clean. That might be the one that wins out of all of them. Or who knows, it could be this one from Neutrogena. So we will have to see. And next up, I have a product from Cetaphil. This is new. This is their Gentle SA Cleanser for acne and combination skin, clinically proven salicylic acid to help maintain an even looking complexion. So I was really intrigued. This has white tea and aloe in it, and my skin responds very well to um, white tea. Salicylic acid, it's like give and take, it's hit or miss, it depends on the product, but Cetaphil is very reliable, especially for acne prone skin. So I figured, why not? And then to go kind of hand in hand with this along the same genre of product, this is the CeraVe Acne Foaming Cleanser, but this one has 4% benzoyl peroxide gel in it. It helps clear acne pimples, prevent new breakouts, and allows skin to heal. It maintains the skin's moisture barrier and leaves your skin feeling comfortable with three essential ceramides, hyaluronic acid, and my favorite, niacinamide. So niacinamide is just literally an award-winning ingredient for me. If something says it has niacinamide, I will purchase it. Um, so this is what it looks like here. Kind of similar packaging, um, except this uh, the one from CeraVe has 25 milliliters more than the one from Cetaphil. And I believe they were around the same price. So, And then along with the CeraVe um, foaming cleanser in the same line, this is new as well, is the acne control gel with 2% salicylic acid. Helps clear acne pimples, minimizes pores, and hydrates while maintaining the protective skin barrier. So this one has three essential ceramides, glycolic and lactic acids, and it's also free of skin drying alcohols which is really nice because if you've ever dealt with a breakout 
if you know, you know, the majority of um, acne healing products or acne preventing products are very drying to the skin. So I'm excited to try those out. This was a fun find. I didn't know that my drugstore sold the brand Purity and I was also able to get this on sale because it was a Christmas set. So I got this for $22. This is the Pure and Refined Cleanse and, Cleanse and Exfoliate Kit from Philosophy. So it comes with a 90 milliliter or 3.0 fluid ounces of the One Step Facial Cleanser with Meadow Foam Seed Oil and as well the 90 milliliter or 3.4 fluid ounces micro delivery facial, facial wash with exfoliating fine grain desert earth, which I, I don't. I don't know, I don't know what that means, like, fine grain desert earth. I don't know what that means, sincerely, from the bottom of my heart, I have no idea. Um, but I thought that these would be really nice just to test out, and they were a really good size and came out basically to, like, $11 each. So, last two skincare products and then we're done with today's video is from a new brand that I've never seen. This is called Bioma. This is the creamy jelly cleanser with triceramide complex, licorice root and green tea. So first of all, how freaking cute is this packaging? Let me open this. So look at this with like cute little pump yellow cute 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 i really like the packaging of this i thought this was so fun so this is supposed to hydrate and brighten an ultra hydrating daily cleanser featuring our triceramide complex antioxidant rich licorice root and green tea the ph balanced jelly formula transforms into a rich creamy lather to melt away the day leaving skin refreshed clean and makeup free without disrupting the skin barrier so that's something that i've really been foc focusing on recently is just maintaining my skin's natural ph balance and protecting the skin barrier so hopefully that will prevent help and prevent any future breakouts and then as well as the face wash i got the bioma clarifying serum the tr with triceramide complex blue tansy pha and zinc so that's what this looks like right here. Again, I'm sorry, their packaging just makes me so excited. So the description of this one, it says a clarifying booster with triceramide complex, blue tansy, PHA, and zinc to target imperfections and help unclog pores without irritating or disrupting the skin barrier for a calmer, clearer complexion. So Bioma is a new brand at the drugstore that I am very, very, very excited to try. And these products just sound fantastic. I hope that you enjoyed today's video featuring everything skincare, body care, hair care that I purchased recently from the drugstore. Stay tuned and subscribe so you don't miss part two because we're going to be talking about drugstore makeup goodies that I am super excited to try. So hit the like button, please, and subscribe before you go. And I will see you very soon in my next video.